Read a book every day for small children. Hey awesome readers, let's read this book, Merry Christmas Peppa. It is Christmas Day, Peppa and her family are opening their presents. Peppa unwraps a toy car. George unwraps a toy aeroplane. Hooray! They cheer. Room. Daddy Pig reminds them to be careful when playing. But Peppa is too excited. She trips and bumps her arm. Ow! Peppa says. She's very hurt. Thankfully, Mummy Pig knows just who to call. Dr. Brown Bear. Dr. Brown Bear is sitting at his desk. A bumped arm, you say? And on Christmas Day? I'll be right there. Dr. Brown Bear says. Dr. Brown Bear arrives at Peppa's house. Can you wiggle your fingers? He asks Peppa. Peppa can. That's very good. Dr. Brown Bear says. But just to be safe, we'll take a trip to the hospital. At the hospital, Dr. Brown Bear takes Peppa to see Miss Rabbit. Miss Rabbit is the nurse. Peppa looks around. She sees lots of Christmas decorations. Ooh, Miss Rabbit, the hospital is all Christmassy, Peppa says. Yes, Miss Rabbit replies. Looks lovely, doesn't it? Miss Rabbit takes a picture of Peppa's arm with the x-ray. An x-ray shows her the bones inside Peppa's body. The x-ray shows your arm will be fine, Miss Rabbit announces. And for being so brave, you get a sticker. Hooray! Peppa cheers. Peppa loves stickers. Peppa walks out of Miss Rabbit's office. She sees a bed with Pedro Pony in it. Pedro Pony has bumped his leg. He has a sticker too. But Pedro looks sad. I am sad because Father Christmas hasn't come, says Pedro Pony. Peppa is alarmed. That means Pedro hasn't gotten a Christmas present. Then... Peppa and Pedro hear a voice in the hallway. Ho, ho, ho! The voice says it's Father Christmas. I'm here with Pedro's Christmas present, Father Christmas says. Sorry, I'm a bit late. I got stuck in a chimney. Father Christmas laughs. Ha, 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 ha. Thank you, Miss Rabbit, for looking after everyone at Christmas time. Peppa loves Christmas, even if it's at the hospital. Merry Christmas!